I'm gonna fire up the compressor and clean out those bolt holes and uh, just give everything a good clean down. I am really impressed with the cleaning power of WD-40. So it's just standard WD-40 aerosol. Uh, over the weekend, like I've been saying, I've just been coating this with WD-40, not with the intention of softening up the carbon and what have you. Um, it was actually just uh, to protect it and, and drive out moisture. But like the tops of the pistons looked really, really rubbish to start with. And now they're just looking awesome. So, yeah, that obviously has something in it that um, breaks down the carbon. I know I've said this a couple of times, but if you're looking at this video as like a how-to guide, you've, you've come to the wrong place. I, this is the first time I've done anything like this, um, taking a head off. Uh, and I, I actually don't know the proper process, so don't follow this as a how-to guide. I'm just sharing my experience that I'm having, um, and I'm showing you what's happening along the way so that you can get a feel for it. Um, yeah, there, there may be some helpful hints along the way, but it's not. So if you're like a professional mechanic sitting there at home and you're thinking, oh, I wouldn't do it that way, that's fine. I'm not claiming that it's the right way. But, but the purpose of all these videos is really just to show you um, in this amateur setting, at home, doing a head, getting one online, testing the quality of the head. Uh, that, that's all it's about uh, at the end of the day. So obviously there's going to be things that aren't right. And I get that. Um, I'm, not, I'm not trying to say that, it's, um, that I'm a mechanic or anything. But any stretch of the imagination. Anyway... Um, what I was going to do is I've cut these old head bolts here, I've cut the, the, the top off them and I'm just going to fit those into a few of the head bolt locations just to help guide everything down uh, as I'm lowering it and just keep everything nice and true. Make it so that I can undo them in the end. Let's do them finger tight. Obviously, they're not they're not doing anything apart from guiding the head down. Now I just I just had worried that you know you, you'd lower the head, but what if the gasket had shifted um, and then you go to drop your head bolts in? and they don't go through and then you're trying to position the head gasket I, d I just feel like this was a smart idea to to just help everything locate itself nicely whether it's right or wrong who knows I don't want to put this one here Everything's looking nice and clean. So I've heard mechanics call this the deck. This part of the engine, the deck.
Interesting, if you're looking for your engine number, your engine number is printed just here. And you can actually see that even when the head's on. So it's just behind your alternator. Um, and if you've got a vacuum pump, it's sort of like right in the center of your alternator and your vacuum pump. But on the block.